Okay, I did say that these videos I was gonna give share some of my experiences and whatever and um, to hopefully encourage and uh, some things I've learned from my bad experiences. Now um, one of my bad experiences is this age old two wordy cliche on foreseen circumstances. Ain't you planned something to a T to perfection and you have unforeseen circumstances. It's crazy, it's one of the soul destroying stuff you could ever, ever, ever have, you know, when you got something planned and it just something which you cannot plan for happens. Um, two occasions I can I want, I want to share with you in terms of when I was doing the events. Um, I went to GR Live and Triple E to actually them guys were coming. And guess what happens? A volcano erupts in, um, in I think it was Iceland. And um, and next thing I know, but it could affect um, travel in the planes. Now basically, there's no planes coming in and out of the country. I was like, oh my goodness. And it was about two, less than two, a month, a month and a half to go. Did not know what to do and whatever. Praise God, it worked out really great. But that was a killer. That was absolute clear. Another instance was last year I was doing Affinity. Uh, the, um, the guys in Tony know that you know I'm um, doing the videos and I'm planning to do certain things with promotions and stuff like that still for the last couple of weeks. And then my four gigabyte hard drive with all my projects and videos that I was working on for the past uh, three months. Now you're gonna say why don't you back it up? But when you get the top of the range hard drive and it's only three months, you don't really back up every two seconds. You just you know what I mean? You spend X amount of money and it's barely a year old. You know, you think it's cool? But unfortunately, due to unforeseen circumstances, the hard drive broke down. Now, you might think, why am I telling you all this? Now, one of the mistakes I did make is stress over it. It's so easy in hindsight to stress over it. Like, you see, that God is, oh my God, what do I do? There's nothing I can do about a volcano. There's nothing I can do about the hard drive's already broken. It's about focus on what you've got to do now. Let go on what to do now. Now, I must admit, the hard drive was a bit of a closer experience, uh, closer um, in terms of time frame, because last year sometime. And, um, Personally, I felt way better when I said, you know what, it's broken, let it go. It took me a week to get there, and I said, let it go, I let it go, and then, ugh, it's just like, yeah, okay, right, let me just do what I've got to do, and get off it. I can't do what I need to do, but I've done the best I can to this time, and sometimes, all you can do is the best. Sometimes, you're just going to put your hands up and say, whatever happens, happens. Scared to be like that? I'm afraid that no one can control the future, no one can control tomorrow, no one can control anything around you. You see, nothing is guaranteed. So for me, my encouragement that unforeseen circumstances will come, but my encouragement is to focus on let it go and just get moving. Don't allow the situation to get you down because you can easily get depressed and, and things just, just get you mad and ah! But my encouragement is, is for you to um to you know, just get going, you know what I mean? But hopefully, someone get, somebody will hopefully um, be be uh, uh, blessed by this. You know, it's not only you or me that this happens to, it happens to everyone, you know what I mean? It's nothing new, yeah? But listen, God bless.